this might be ruining your life, bro. This might really just be ruining your life. What's good with y'all, man, guys? Listen up, bro. This is the dark truth about no fat. Okay, this is what people are not understanding and or they're not being told. Do not generalize every single thing you hear. Just like there are exceptions, just like there are differences of people. Just like when I make video on women, hey, some women aren't offended. You know why? Because the shoe don't fit. That's not their character. Same thing with you guys. Yo, no fat should be teaching you discipline, guys. The reason why I say no fat is good is a benefit is if you don't have any dick discipline, right? We got guys out here that's literally trying to walk around like they don't see no cheeks around. I'm starting to think that some of y'all might be playing for the other team, bro. Here's the thing, bro. Don't take it to the extreme, okay? Don't take it to the extreme of, oh, I can't look at no ass. Any girl that's walking by me, I might just get hard. I might just, bro, relax, relax, okay? This is not a cult, all right, bro? It's just teaching you, hey, control. You need control, bro. When you get with a woman, don't you want to be able to last longer, right? Got videos on that on my Patreon, but... In general, you want to make sure you're desensitizing your brain to all the stuff that's out here. Just so, like, look at it as training, bro. When you're in the gym, you know what I'm saying? Guys, you can't just get rid of all women. Okay, I love women. I love booty cheeks. You know what I'm saying? But have the control over it. Have the control over yourself. Have control over your desires. The dick discipline is what is teaching you. When you get a hold of that, then bro, just keep that frame, keep that mindset so you're not just willy-nilly thirsty over any bitch. So you're not thirsty over any chick that walked by. You got a chick that's damn near a six with makeup on and done up. She's a six and you over here, oh my gosh, like those guys that are like that, they definitely need some nofap training. But that's what the shit is, bro. It should be a training arc. Now we definitely not fucking with no porn. Get rid of that. Stop watching that period. You need to stop watching that shit. That's definitely tearing your mind up. That's definitely screwing with you, bro. Because we got guys out here partnering up with Jergens. We got brothers double sponsored out here by Suave. Left hand, right hand. These guys going to Kimbo. Ambidextrous with the glizzies. Going crazy. Pause. Pause. Going crazy on this shit. Busting all these nuts on themselves because they can't go a day without watching something. Like, bro, relax. Okay, relax. No fap is training, bro. Anytime you see cheeks out here and you start to get lost in the sauce, you know what I'm saying? You in a gym and there's some big old booty cheeks want to bend over in front of you, bro. Relax. Just look at it as training. Okay, bitch. Them cheeks looking nice, but I'm, hey, I'm going to stay on my set. I'm a, Bro, you don't got to get mad. Okay. You ain't got to be no hate about it. You're just training your mind. When you pull up Instagram on your feed, if you see some cheeks, you're not phased by, okay. You, obviously it's out here okay it's out here these chicks are not gonna stop thirst trapping they're not gonna stop wanting attention that's just how it is they will be showing their ass forever okay what you gonna do walk around with blinders you can't do it bro so this is your training this is where guys go wrong they spend too much time doing this right and guess what now you don't even see women as attractive anymore because see no fab you can still have a chick helping you bust nuts no fab is just saying hey i'm not gonna freaking bust nuts on myself i'm not gonna sit out here whip out this lotion right whip out this cocoa butter and start smacking my johnson myself i'm not finna do that i'm finna let a woman play with my johnson i'm finna let a woman help me bust nuts good now semen retention you might just need to take a break for a short period of time but not these guys talking about some 9,000 days semen retention. Boy, that's cap. Okay, and that's not voluntarily, bro. You you just not trying to be a better man. You're not trying to be the best version of yourself. So women are finding you attractive to want to help you bust nuts. If some woman out here that you're attracted to want to help you bust nuts, cool. Don't let it go to the extreme of, oh, man, I can't stand women. It, oh, man, just, every time I see some butt cheeks, man, I just get angry. Bro, what are you getting angry about? What are you getting angry about? All you got to do is turn your attention somewhere else. You got to be so trained that it's not even phasing you. Cheeks come up to me and want to be shown in my face all the time. When I'm in the gym, bro, it seems like chicks go out of their way to 
literally put their butt cheeks in front of my face. And am I sitting here getting mad or complaining about it? Hell no. That means that you're being chosen by women. Women find you attractive. So they want to show their ass to you to see if it's enticing enough for you to see if it'll make your Johnson jump up out of your pants. They might want to let you get inside of them. Most likely, they probably want to let you get inside of them. That's a good sign, bro. That means you are putting in work. That means when women see you, they getting turned on. When women see you, they ovaries do a backflip. So they want to make sure they put these butt cheeks in front of your face. It's up to you to have the discipline over yourself to be like, okay, that's nice, but I'm focused, right? I'm focused. We're men, bro. That's what it's supposed to be. If you have trouble sticking to no fat, right? If you have trouble not busting nuts on yourself, then what you need to do is separate yourself as much as you can from those type of things that's going to make you do that, bro, until you get a hold of it. As soon as you get a hold of it, bro, which means you got to let go of your Johnson. You got to put that lotion down, bro. Put the lotion down. Okay. Wouldn't you rather have a woman help you bust nuts? Good. So here's what you got to do. You got to lock in with yourself mentally. So you're not thirsty at the sight of booty cheeks or women. Cool. Discipline. Next thing you got to do, get your ass in the gym. Make sure you're working on your body as a man. That's what you need to be doing. In my opinion, you got to be prepared as a man, physically fit as a man. Everybody should be getting fit, but definitely men. Definitely men, bro. Women, all they really need to do is hit legs, abs, some back. Is anybody really checking a woman's arms? Like, oh, flex for me. They post arm day. And what do you see? The same shit. You see the same shit unless they shooting up testosterone and they finally get some kind of growth in their arms. But what man really cares about that shit, right? Just be lean, get them thighs and that gluteus maximus right. That's what we after. That's what we looking at. Guess what? As a man, your whole body, get your whole body together. So you got a lot of work to do. You got a lot of work to do mentally, physically. You got a lot of preparation, bro. So you need to be focused on that instead of just concerning yourself with at the sight of some butt cheeks. It's, it's, it's stirring some kind of anger inside of you. Why? 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 Women are here to help you. <laughs> Women are here to help you bust some nuts, bro. Women are here to show you, hey, you looking good. So I'm going to put these cheeks in your face. Women are here to show you, hey, I'm going to help you bust some nuts. You should be having fun. Look at it as fun, bro. This is your training arc. If you're doing no fat, if you're participating in no fat, it's your training arc. That's it, bro. Do not take it further. Do not take it to the extreme of hate because I don't understand why I got, bro, female nature is going to be female nature at the end of the day. Okay. I'm not trying to save the whole world from attention whores. It's just going to be what it is, bro. You got to control yourself. Okay. Leave it at that. Leave it at that. It's ruining guys' lives because they putting too much focus on seeing that as a negative which yeah a female that's seeking attention for her body period and selling her body and shit obviously interferes with your moral compass right i understand obviously it's not good for her soul it is what it is though am i gonna sit here and tell her there's a better life out here babe you don't have to do that you should do this and why don't you get a job like other people that are actually work hard for their money. I'm not finna tell them that. I'm not finna tell these OnlyFans chicks that. I'm not finna tell any of these strippers that. I'm not finna tell none of them. I'm finna let them do what the hell they do. Because why? You need to be focused on yourself. As long as you cutting out the porn, as long as you stop playing with yourself, busting nuts on yourself, right? Getting that towel all scrunchy and shit. You need to chill out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Put the jerkers down. Put the swab down. Put the cocoa butter down. It's supposed to be used for your body. Keep your skin healthy and moisturized. That's it, bro. Don't take it to the extreme. All right. You got to live life to have fun. You got to live life to enjoy yourself. There needs to be discipline there, but leave it a discipline. Don't take it to hate. Don't take it to, oh man, uh, she choosing me. I'm so mad. She's trying to shake her ass in front of my face. Okay. Does she got a boyfriend with her right there? If she got a man right there and she's doing this shit on purpose for attention, okay, I can understand you being a little irritated. You can separate yourself from that situation. You can change location. Matter of fact, you can choose to not think about it. You can choose to not even acknowledge her. That's what you should do. Don't acknowledge attention whores. Acknowledge the chicks that's out here choosing you when you have the time and you want to choose them back. That's what it is. Leave it at that, bro.